everybody, and welcome to another episode of Girly Girl Previews. Well, it's year 2013, and like I said before, we got new reviews. Yes. Um, this piece that I have here in front of me it was actually a Christmas gift that I got. And it's like January 5th, and I haven't taken it out of this box, mainly because I've been saving it for this review. So, let's see what it is. It is the... My Little Pony Bath Gift Set. This is so, so cute. It's the back. The side is basically the same. The back, the bottom, and the top are kind of bleh. Um, so let's, um, we don't really have to have a uh, open it up to see what it's like because it's really easy to get out. Basically, it just slides out like so. And you have, um, we have proof that Hasbro's trying to cut back on their packaging. Because this is actually just a, actually it's just a picture. It's actually a picture. That's different. Okay. Um, they give us um, the following bath supplies that are currently stuck. There, okay. They give you um, Apple Body Wash. And they give us the Apple Body Lotion with Pinkie Pie on it. And they give us the, it's stuck. It's, it has some sort of glue on it. The apple shampoo with Applejack on it. They also give us a carrying bag with the other main three on it. So that is really cute. Oh my gosh. Uh, also on the back of it, it actually says My Little Pony. That's cute. I've seen other kits of it where just the carrying case has just rarity on it, but that kind of sucks because it's only one of the main six. At least in this case, you get all six of them all together, so that's really nice. Let's start off with the Apple Body Lotion. Now, I've used a lot of lotion because I live up here in Canada and it's very, very dry, so our hands get really chapped, so I know... I know whether or not this is a good scale lotion. The smell is subpar. It's not, it's, it's really apple but then on top it's got like a chemical smell to it. Oh, damn. Let's see the consistency. It's got an okay consistency. Maybe the smell will go down once it's on my hand. Nope, you still have that chemical smell. Ugh. Oh dear. Oh, that's that's not pleasant. <laughs> if it had just been like a basic, um, like a body, like the body shop ones, that would have been easy. That would have been a better one. It would have gotten a better score. So this, this by itself gets a a four out of ten. Maybe a four and a half. The only thing that saves it is the fact that it's Pinkie Pie. Let's try the apple shampoo. Let's see what it smells like. It's got a safety seal on it. The other one has a safety seal too. It just comes off like that. That's it. Oh. This one still suffers from the same problem, except for its chemical smell. It's a little bit less, at least. Wait a sec. That smells really familiar. I can't really pinpoint it. This gets a maybe a 5.5 out of 10, just because the chemical smell is not as bad. Um, let's go with the Apple Body Wash with Twilight on it. It's got a protector piece on top of it as well. Let's 
this actually is tolerable. Um, I have tried other Apple body washes in the past that are like really, really pungent Apple. This barely has any chemical spell. I have to give this a... A 9.5 out of 10. It would have been better if the smell was more prominent, more pungent, but hey, it's better than the, um, better than the body lotion. So, yeah. 9.5 out of 10. And now for the big test to see if all three of these will actually, in fact, fit in the case. It has a little zipper on the top here. It's full of crap. <laughs> Let's see. I'll stand up here. One end. It's looking kind of, kind of bleak. Let's see if they fit. It's advertised that they're supposed to fit. All of them. It's barely fitting. That's what she said. <laughs> no, it doesn't look like they all fit. Dang. It would have been cute if they let all fit. But yeah, every every way I'm going here, it's kind of not fitting. It would be better as a pencil case. But, um, so the pen this thing by itself, I have to give it a... Uh, 9.5 out of 10. The only problem is that they all don't fit, none, all of them don't fit in one case. That's the only bummer. So, yeah, um, all in all, I'd have to give this kit a 6 out of 10. It has up its flaws. It's cute if you're a major collector, but uh, I wouldn't really personally buy it unless you got it for a gift. So, yeah, until um, next time, people, this has been Inner Sky Pie for another episode of Girly Girly Preview saying, I don't got a single word going through my head that makes sense, and these are supposed to fit in here, but they don't. That's just weird. See you guys next time.